hi guys this is your girl sam and welcome back to my channel so for today's video it's gonna be the halloween special on my channel and we'll call it a glam and gore so it's gonna be two parts so for the part one where what we're doing right now is i will do the glam part so as you can see i do have my um, base and brows on to save time because we'll be focusing more on the eyes so i want it to be slick i want it to be sexy and at the same time i want it to look a little evil so we'll be focusing on the eyes now for the part two for the next video we'll be doing the gore part so it's gonna be a talk to video and i will be sharing this you how will i do my eyes and other parts of the face so please continue watching So to start off, I'll be using a base for my eyes. So I'll be using a concealer since I don't have any primer on. So it's better to use a concealer so that the colors that we'll be using later on will pop up. So I'll be putting it all over my leads. So next, I'll be using the Eye Magic Pro palette and we'll get a white or off-white eyeshadow to set the concealer that we put on a while ago. So from the same palette, I will get a dark red eyeshadow and will put it outside my outer corner. Also, I'll be winging out the eyeshadow. So, blend it inwards and wing the eyeshadow. So, don't worry if it looks like a mess right now. We are doing a cut crease, so mainly the eyeshadow will be focused on the upper part of our eyes. So I'll be getting the black eyeshadow from the same palette and we put it on the outer corner and blending it all together. I'm just using two eyeshadows for this look. So we'll get the same concealer that we used as our primer a while ago. And we'll be cutting the crease. So dito, tinaas ko ng onte yung pagka-cut crease. Kasi kapag um, binabaan ko siya, and I, if I would follow my natural um, beads, hindi makikita yung cut crease mismo dun sa eyes. So take your time to do cut crease because it takes a lot of practice to do it and perfect. Once I'm done lining the part of the crease, I'm filling it in so that it would pop. So the same base that we used a while ago is I will set the concealer in place so that the concealer won't move. So I'll be doing a wing eyeliner. So here I'm using the Maybelline Hyper Sharp Wing Liner in black. So I'll create a wing complementing the cut crease that we did. Same goes for the other side. So since I have put my wing eyeliner on, I'll be putting 
my false eyelashes and this one are Taiwan lashes. So to blend the false eyelashes to the real eyelashes, I'll be using a mascara and to dust it off the powders that we set a while ago that falls off to the eyelashes. I also extend my eyeliner inwards and don't forget to put on the lower lashes. So for the contour, I'll be using the Vice Cosmetics Aura Contour in the shade Contour. So for the contour, I'm making it a little heavy since our eyes has a little heavy as well. Don't forget to blend your contour so that you can avoid harsh line. For the blush, I'm using the Caroline Oil Control Blush in the shade Fresh Tomato and I'm putting it on the upper part of the contour. For the highlight, I'm using the Everbelena Advanced Strobe Highlighter. So for the lips, I'm using the MAC Bullet Lipstick in the shade Cashmere. So, <laughs> hindi ko pala um, na ibaba ng gusto yung mirror, but I apply it all over my lips. So that is it guys for our video for today. So stay tuned for part 2. It's gonna be up probably tomorrow. So for the meantime, follow me on my social media account. On Instagram is at Eloisa Maria 2 underscore and on Facebook it's Zambalion. Also like this video if you want more content like this. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't and click the notification bell to get updated at my every upload. Again, this is your girl Samuel. See you on my next videos. Bye!